Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Today I want to introduce you my absolute favorite all-rounder ointment, Tiger Balm. There's two versions, the red one and the white one. Why? What is the effects and what are the risks of both of them? Stay tuned. Let's start with the red ointment. The red version has added essential cinnamon oils, which leads to the typical red color, as well as a heating effect when you apply it on your skin. This heating effect can increase your blood circulation, which can help healing muscles. For that reason, this ointment is very useful for all kinds of sore muscle or tendons, as well as stiff neck or back pain, especially also in the lower back if you sit a lot during the day. An additional effect of this, which I'm mainly using it for actually, is all kinds of insect bites, especially if you have a lot of problems with mosquito bites. Right after you get the bite, you just add this and the itch will stop in a matter of one or two minutes. It's magic. The next is the white version. The white version doesn't have the cinnamon oils, instead more peppermint and eucalyptus oils, which gives it the typical creamy white color, which has more of a cooling effect in comparison to the heating effect of the red ointment. Typical things you can use this for is if you're having a cold, you can for example apply this to your chest or if you're having a stuffed nose, you can apply it under your nose and when you breathe in, you're gonna free your airways, which is a really nice feeling. You might know it from other peppermint or eucalyptus products. You can also use the white one for all sorts of headaches. Apply the ointment on your forehead or your temples, depending on where your ache is located and it's gonna help you. Basically, it is to say that both of the ointments can be used to treat similar issues. It really depends on if you feel more comfortable with the heating effect or the cooling effect. In my case, I just have both of them. So depending on what issue I have, I apply the one which I feel will work better. But you can basically have one of them and use it for all kinds of effects. Now to the risks and the reasons why you should definitely keep this away from your kids. The ointment should definitely not be used with all sorts of open wounds or damaged skin. That includes sunburns, for example. You should not use that because it can be very painful and unhealthy. You should also be very careful to not get the ointment in contact with all kinds of mucous membrane, like your mouth, your eyes, or other sensitive areas of your body. Additionally, you should not use this right before or right after a shower, because your skin might be a bit sensitive. That would be not a very pleasant experience. So, thanks for watching the video. If you're interested in getting one of these, or both of them, just check the link in the description. It's an Amazon affiliate link, so if you buy it there, you're not going to pay more, but we will be supported with a small commission from Amazon, which will help our channel, so thank you for that. If you liked the video, please give a like to the video, and if you have any questions about the product, just comment right below the video. You would give us a lot of support if you could subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you soon. Until then, bye-bye.